Hi friends, this is Shivani here. Welcome to my channel Shivani Creations. Today I am showing you how to create this very cute 3D origami owl pen stand or pencil holder. Isn't it very pretty? You can create it very easily and in just few hours. So I will show you step by step. For this we need liquid glue, scissor, green, orange and dark brown color craft paper. First I will show you how to create origami piece. For this I am taking this 5.5 by 4 cm craft paper. This is a 90 GSM craft paper. So just follow the instructions to create the origami piece. So piece is ready and you will get two pockets in the bottom. In the same way we need 300 brown pieces and 144 orange pieces and also we need 25 light green color pieces. So first I will show you how to create pairs. Just take one brown piece, add glue inside right pocket and insert one piece from bottom like this. So in the same way we need total 12 brown pairs. So this is done. Now taking one orange piece, add glue in right pocket and insert one brown piece. So in the same way we need total 12 pairs using orange and brown color. So all 12 brown and 12 orange brown pairs are ready. In total there are 24 pairs. So I am assembling first and second row. First connect two orange brown pairs then two brown pairs. Then again I am adding two orange brown pairs and continue this till the end. So we have reached till the end now I am just joining it and creating the base like this. So in one row there are total 24 pieces. Now I am starting with third row. So on top of two orange pieces I am adding one orange piece then three brown color pieces. Then again one orange piece, then three brown pieces and continue this. So this is done. Now I am starting with 4th row. So 
so on top of orange color piece i am adding two orange pieces and remaining gap i am filling with two brown pieces so this is done now proceeding to the fifth row on top of orange pieces i am connecting one brown piece beside the brown piece i am adding two orange pieces on left and right sides on the remaining part i will cover with brown color piece now starting with sixth row so on top of this brown piece i am adding two brown pieces alternatively then i am adding two orange pieces in between so this is also done now i'm proceeding to the seventh row on top of orange piece i'm adding orange pieces in between i'm adding three brown pieces So this is also done now I am proceeding to the 8th row So again I am following the same process as we did earlier in the bottom So here I am creating the diamond shape and this is very easy to follow so just enjoy the tutorial and if you have any doubt regarding this you can ask me freely in comment section
now I am starting with the last row that is 14th row. So 14th row is also done. Now start with any center point. Adding one green piece. And on left and right side of this green piece, I am adding four brown pieces. Here I am creating the head part of owl now I am adding two green pieces then add three brown pieces on left and right sides then I am adding two more green pieces and then two brown pieces on left and right sides Then again two green pieces, then I am adding one brown piece on left and right side, then again two green pieces like this. Now in the same way I am covering in the right side by adding some green pieces. So here I have created the mountain of green pieces. In the same way I will complete the mountain on this side. So after adding mountain on both the sides, the head part of the owl is ready. And now the remaining pieces I will cover with brown color. So this is done. Now I am making wings, for this I am taking total 11 pieces of brown color and I am just joining these pieces one by one and just making little curved shape. So I have already created one more wing, now I am connecting both the wings like this. So this is done and I have already created eyes by just drawing eye shape on white color paper using some colored markers and for the beak I am adding one white color piece like this now I am connecting the base so I have already cut one circle shape cardboard or thick sheet as a base so just adding glue and connecting like this let it dry for some time so it's completely dried and our pen stand or pencil holder is ready isn't it very cool idea for your desk organizer 
so you can just put your markers sketch pens colored pens pencils anything inside this box so my project is done for today hope you enjoyed my video please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos and please click on bell icon for the latest updates thanks for watching see you next time bye